Hello guys, today I'll be reviewing Loadout, which came out yesterday, which was January 31st. And Loadout is free on Steam. Well, you could actually go to loadout.com, I think, or .net, and you can download it from there, but I think you will still need Steam, so anyway. It's free to play, it's an action indie game, it came out yesterday, as already said. Um, you can buy the DLC... You get like 20k coins and some uh, wardrobes, was it wardrobe, it's clothing, whatever. And in my opinion, you don't need to get this one because you're just gonna like spend 90 euros on clothing and 20k coins. And yeah, so this game is pretty fun and I'll talk with you more when I get into the gameplay. I'll see you there. Okay, now we're in the game, so basically when you start the game, it will let you register, which the registration is like fairly simple. You write your in-game name, your login name, your password, and Gmail, I think. Yeah, and you just press login, you don't need to confirm any emails or any stuff like that, so you just enter and you see the screen where you can find the um, home button, which is this. You can see the fight, weapon, crafting, loadout, outfitter, locker, tech tree, and store. And on the dry top screen, you can see like the credits who created this game and shit. And you can manage your friends actually, but I don't have any, so yeah, that that's not really good. Anyway, you can change the settings, or you can always exit the game if you don't like this game, or you're just that bad it is, like me. So anyway. First, I think we should go and check out the settings. Um, in the game settings, you can find like gore, nudity, and profanity. If you don't want to see any of these, you can always disable these. You can change the regions. I picked Europe because it has the lowest ping, because I live in Europe. So, yeah. You can always enable camera bob, which is set whether or not you can handle a little motion in your ocean while sprinting okay I did not understand that but I disabled it because I don't like motion for some weird reason but yeah you can always change the language as well you have the tutorials name tags and that's about it probably for this part of the game then you have graphics where you can change the gamma correction if you have a uh, shit your screen and it's not changing for some weird reason Okay, maybe, yeah, it's not changing. I have it set at 3. You can always change the aspect ratio to widescreen, standard. <clears throat> then we have screen resolution, which is good, but I cannot change it to lower for some reason. And then you have the quality of the graphics. I'm playing on medium, so I could have more frames per second. Then you have a uh, wait for a vertical sync, show FPS, colorblind mode, feel of view. This is a beast. If you have like a um, small screen or something, I think you should adjust this one so you could see more with your eyeballs, as it said. Then you have the controls, camera sensitivity, controller stick sensitivity, camera acceleration, double tap action. You can change it to none. It's basically when you double tap F, you, it die rolls. You can change it to sprint or nothing then you have invert look enable toggle aim downside controller umber, 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 umber. and then you have def camera smoothing and then you have key binds where you can change everything which is fucking awesome you can change any of these you can always use an xbox controller thing yeah you, you can and then you have audio master volume music volume I had music volume up because the music is like WTF. <clears throat> then you have sound effects volume. Uh, hit indicator, it's at 4% because every time you hit someone with a bullet, this is the sound that it makes. Imagine that, like, shooting every time, like, that's, like, really annoying. Then you can voiceover volume, UI volume, and speaker configuration. You can change to no subwoofer. We have a good system like me. You can change it to subwoofer. Okay, then you save. You have 
five weapon crafting loadouts after lock it or take to your store. Let's try out weapon crafting maybe. <coughs> yeah, I already created a gun, it's the Jesus Blaster. If you want to customize or like create a new one, you like right like shitty shit. Then you press okay. And now you can create your gun. You can change the stock. Yep. It has a lot of upgrades. <clears throat> you have you could actually make a lot of like different classes. Oh, it just looks badass. Ready, but you can upgrade you can have from iron sights to even X-ray. Optical zoom bio scanner recon scope. You can change the barrel. Headhunter, what was it? Uh, heavy sniper off but okay. Okay. You can change them, but it chooses your. Um, it looks like Infinity War, but <clears throat> it's not. So yeah. Okay. Wait, what's this? Oh yeah, you can change it from like your gun is like going to be slugs or it fires Tesla, which is electrical damage. Then you have health, which heals. <clears throat> then you have pyre, which flame some bitches. Then you have the juice. Use this buff to on your teammates, granting them extra strength and power. Basically, it's like supporting people. Okay, then you can change to any of them. Yeah, if you want, you can pro this as a rifle, <clears throat> a launcher. This looks badass, doesn't it? And then you can change to pulse and beam. I think pulse is the best one, I think. Well, actually, the damage on the launcher is the best, but anyway. 8 points. Maybe this one is better. High tech chase and continuous and it doesn't. And maybe I should actually change this one. Spooling. Spooling. What's spooling? Spooling. Spooling. Exactly. This is great. What did I do? Fully auto. And what's pooling? Mmm. Okay, extremely high rate. Maybe. Okay, I'll basically just try it out. <clears throat> and okay. Contacting. Transaction complete. Saved. Do you want to go to loadout? Yes. <clears throat> and I'm gonna change my loadout. This is how I look. My name is Elga. Yeah, okay, don't smile. You can see those nipples. And then you can go to Outfitter where we can change your Helga. And you can change the clothing, but it costs this money, which I do not have. I think you get them when you like. Holy shit, did she suck? Oh my. Okay. Let's change it to this guy. Okay, you can change the hairstyle. <clears throat> Beard, head, glasses, you can have glass, evil goggles, yeah, that's totally evil. Then you can change the pants, upper body, torso, you can have the taunts. Basically what taunts is, is like dances, which look awesome. You can even have Gangnam Cell. What else? Headbang? <clears throat> yeah, this looks badass. Oh yeah, this one is great. Look, if you have Helga, I'll, I'll show you in a second what I mean. This is what I mean. You see what I mean? And yeah, that's about it. The best ones. Okay, that 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 that's that's, that's great. Okay, locker. Um, yeah, it's awesome. <clears throat> then you have locker. This is your statics, you can change your avatar, which costs, unless you want these three ones. You have like one, two, three, and one more, one the other one for free. The other one costs for some reason. Summary, your statics, statistics, I mean, not statics. And this is the XP to level up and shit. I mean, it's play, it's core per minute, kills, assists, kill the ratio, win loss ratio. Then you have Tech Tree, where you can 
see how much you play with that shit. Pulse, six percent. Another thing, equipment, shield. You can upgrade and expand, collapse, anything. Then you have the store where you can buy gold and XP boosts, which is basically just experience. <clears throat> you can also redeem code. Okay, let's see the prices. You, the good thing is that you buy them for in-game gold, not like for real money. Uh, as you can see, 18k is the max. Loadouts, you can buy a loadout. Oh, cloth, 63k, 9 loadouts, 18 gun slots. That, that sounds awesome. Sleazy pinup, okay, you can buy these ones. Okay, let, let's find lobby now. Okay, there are two different, casual and competitive. Uh, game modes, you can go into casual, play with bots and or either humans, let's play with bots because I suck. Find the game. This shouldn't take a lot of time, you can always multitask, you can do anything you want to. Like, okay, this gun, and it says voting ending. Okay, the countdown. <clears throat> we can change the map, but for some weird reason, it, it was a glitch for a second, as you saw. Yep, uh, you can change the map now. Which one? Okay, let's walk for Trailer Park at night. And in the meantime, let's look at some weapon crafting. Okay, this is a beam weapon. Which one is better? Okay, mine is actually 50 high tech chases that uh, continues beam of energy. You can overheat. That's not good, but. Yeah, you can change the slug health to Tesla. I think I should get Tesla, but I actually don't know how to get this in game like Infinity Ward coins. Just don't get me wrong, this game wasn't created by Infinity Ward. Because if it would, this game would totally suck, but it doesn't, so. <clears throat> yeah, you can also chat with other people. As you can see, you can quit the match, you can press I'm ready so it will start faster. This guy is like writing something, okay, he just said go. Okay, the, uh, the game is starting now, in 3, 2, 1, the warning has ended, and the game is about to start. We're gonna play against bots as I said. It loads pre fairly quickly, like in a few seconds, like 5 or 6 seconds. Okay, maybe it's a bit more than that. Yeah, I've lost connection to the server. Press F7. Bug. I'm having a problem with... Playing this game. My frame row, my game was... And I'm having connection issues. <clears throat> okay. And... Yeah, let's try that again. Okay, it should load faster now. Okay, it's shitty shit. Let's do this. Oh, look at them, they're all guys. Hello, kitty! On my ass. That sounded weird, but. You can always high jump. If you double tap the W, then you press spacebar immediately after doing it, and then whoop! The enemy has scored. And the match is now tied. Wow, this gun is really powerful. The enemy has oh wow, I just got killed. Wow, look at that pose, look at that pose. Well, left click to respawn, um, change loadout for right click, def cam for the middle button. Yeah, let's try to get some boss size bitch kills. <clears throat> and the maps are actually made pretty good they're fun to play they're not too boring at least for now they're not I bet they're gonna be like in Call of Duty in some meantime and let's kill some shit two kills now and my weapon overheated this is not good even my frame rate dropped. So oh, shit, I'm dead. Aren't I? Oh, of course. So, wow. Uh, oh, wow, fuck you, of course. Of course. Let's, let's try to get some more kills. 
until the death. I die and let's 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 send it with this. I'll show the competitive one. The score is now tied. This is like basically like um kill confirmed on Black Ops or any other Call of Duty. Let's kill this one. Okay, I got a double kill. Hopefully my, my teammate will save me. If not, I'll probably die or I'll just save my own self. I'm in the lead. <clears throat> Shitty shit, zero percent. Shitty shit, zero percent. Good. Oh, wow, I just got pwned. Wow. Really? Really? Oh, you jumping. Okay, you can press either H or J to like dance as you can see I, but in the meantime you cannot shoot okay let's kill this shit and, and we got him victory dance as you see we have a lot of them we can have four at a time you can even twerk like Miley would said twerking for life and I'm dead, yes. So let's get into the other game mode. Fight competitive. Find match. Searching for matches. <clears throat> Feel free to leave this screen at any time. We will continue to search for matches in the background. I'll do that, I'll do that. 14 seconds waiting. 15 slug and this one is slug rifle this is bib all right come on oh, okay we, we'll find the lobby this is gonna be players versus players here we go all right good luck just for fun mm -hmm. match begins in 69 64 63 Ready, come on. One more. One more. Go Saiku. I uh, speak Russian. He speaks Russian, guys. <laughs> wow. They will never figure it out. They will never look in that top right corner. Uh, this is pretty annoying when people purposely do not. Click ready. I am speak Polish. That's 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 great. This is taking some time. It, it will take around twenty seconds just to start a game. Wait, maybe not. I can hear the booping sound, but it's still saying like eleven seconds, ten seconds, and <clears throat> that's a lot of time. Yeah, match begins in three, two, one, go! Wow. I did not give a shit about the teams. Jesus Christ. Okay, finally the game is going to begin. So I'll show you what competitive is. There are several maps for now, and I cannot wait for custom games. Okay, load out. Shitty shit. Oh, you, this is basically like Team Fortress 2, I can see even, you can heal yourself, you can get, what the fuck? Okay, let's go, I, I had something in my ass, that's what she said, anyway. Okay, I can see there. A control point has been captured. Okay, I'm trying to get his kill. And I, I might die. Yeah, I did. Oh, buddy, 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 buddy. Okay, this is a teammate. So basically this is what competitive is, it's, you, you need to capture the flag, I'm getting shooted. 
What kind of weapon does he have? It's so powerful. Wow, I died again. Really? <clears throat> As you can see, it's pretty brutal. But sometimes. And my frame rate just dropped to 30. Where, where is he? I saw him. Control point captured. Go, 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 go! Go, catch, go! No! A bit more! Come on! Wow, assist, really. Need to come. Oh my god. Uh, as you can see, uh, I might have lost my arm. And I'm. I'm about to die, but. I still. Uh, I think I'll get another kill and then I'll die. Or at least I'll try. Where are they? I can see this guy camping. Okay, I'm dead. Of course. Basically, this is a whole game. If you want to exit, escape, leave game. And yeah, this is a whole game. It's pretty fun. You can play it with your friends and just run by your own. If you like this video, be sure to leave it a like and try out this game for yourself. Subscribe, share with your friends. It would help me a lot. It would put a smile on my face. And I'll see you next time. Peace.